So as an automotive enthusiast, I have something really embarrassing to admit. I suck at drifting. Two years ago, I came here to the BMW driving experience near the Zonport racetrack. It was a really cool day. I got to drive a bunch of different BMW M cars and part of that experience allowed you to drift. Now the problem was I realized how bad I was at drifting, especially when driving big V8 BMW M cars. So what I'm doing today is another driving experience here and it's gonna be a drift experience where I actually get to learn how to drift properly. So let's jump into it. <laughs> That's not what I expected. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's see how it goes. I did good the first time. I don't know if... Uh, now it's the third time, right? Third time, let's see. And the first time was already really good. <laughs> ah, I was in... Ah, I was in first. <laughs> uh, a bit too slow with the steering. Try to look for that. Try to do this first. Ooh, that one is slippery. <laughs> so of course the one on camera is probably the worst yeah. one yet. <laughs> Should I see? So again, really slippery, but here uh, we're gonna... So this is what we're doing now. <laughs> yeah, you get a feel for it once you get once you get it. So we're having a break right now, but we just did the Solemn course there, the Rotunda drifting there, and we have one more over here that we're gonna do next. So three different drift trainings. I think I've gotten better, but let's see. <laughs> Next. Get out. Get out of the 
Two are staring input. Keep the rest of the front wheels. Clear. Middle on the stair, middle on the stair. <laughs> Perfect. There we go. Nice one. <laughs> All right, I'm getting the hang of it a little bit more. So it's the end of the day now. We finished up the drift course, and it was amazing. Today was so much fun. Got to drift the two series coupe in three different courses, the slalom course, the uh, roundabout, and then a kind of a final uh, drift course that was uh, a little bit less slippery than what we had done before. It was great to learn the techniques and feel what you should be feeling when you're drifting. I mean, okay, for people who know how to do this, it's probably a no brainer, but for me, I haven't had too much experience with this. So it was really great to really know what to feel for. Especially now that I drive a rear wheel drive car, it's good to know that if I do find myself in a drift accidentally, I know what to do. You know, it was really cool to be able to do these types of experiences. One of the reasons that I love this place is because they have a bunch of different BMW experiences. So even for people who don't drive BMWs, it's nice to do these driving experiences. So I'd highly recommend this place if you live in the Netherlands or, or live close by and are interested in these types of experiences. But going back to the drift lesson, it was awesome. Highly recommend it. Really glad that I got to have this experience and uh, look forward to maybe doing another more advanced course. So I still have a lot of work to do to up my drift game, but hopefully this is the start and uh, I can do some more practicing later on in the future. Thanks so much for watching. If you need more information about this place, if you want more information about these BMW drift experiences or any other experiences this place has, I'll link to them in the description below. And until the next time, thanks so much for watching.